In this video, I'm going to find the unit normal for the level k, which is given by exponent of x sine y is equals to a constant c at the point 0 pi. So to find uh, that unit normal, I would have to use uh, the properties of the gradient of a scalar field. So we know that uh, for the gradient of a scalar field, phi is normal to any level k, phi is equals to a constant c. So in this case, we are given that level k exponent of x sine y is equal to a constant. So we would uh, deduce that our phi of x, y, the scalar field is exponent of x sine y. Then we'll be looking at, at the point 0 pi. So we now need to evaluate our gradient of uh, that uh, scalar field. And by definition, if we have a scalar field phi of x, y, the gradient which you denote by grad phi is uh, the partial derivative of phi with respect to xi plus the partial derivative of phi with respect to yj. So I will write my grad phi there, partial derivative of phi with respect to xi plus the partial derivative of phi with respect to yj. Substitute our phi, we are saying our phi there is exponent of x sine y. So we'll be having the partial derivative of exponent of x sine y with respect to xi plus the partial derivative of exponent of x sine y with respect to y and j. So I will now go on and uh, differentiate. Looking at this one here, we are differentiating with respect to x, treating y as if it's a constant. So therefore, the result there being exponent of x sine y i. Now on this part, we are differentiating with respect to y, treating x as if it's a constant. So the result there that we get is exponent of x cosine y j. So that's our grad phi there. The next step is to evaluate grad phi at the point 0 pi. That is, we set x equals to 0, y equals to pi, and substitute them into our grad phi here. So on the first part there, if we substitute x equals to 0, y equals to pi, this sign pi will give us a 0 there, so we'll just remain with a 0 where we have the i there. And here, if we substitute x 0, y equals to pi, the exponent of x gives us a 1, the cosine of y gives us a minus 1. So we we'll have our grad phi at the point 0 pi is equals to minus j. So we have our grad phi at the point 0 pi. This grad phi at the point 0 pi, it is giving us the normal to the level k of exponent of x sine y equals to c. But what we want to find here is the unit normal. For us to find the unit normal, we divide the given factor by its norm. So our unit normal will be grad phi divided by the norm of uh, grad phi. Our grad phi is a uh, minus j there. So our unit normal will be minus j divided by the norm of minus j. And that will give us minus j divided by the square root of minus 1 squared. And that will simplify to minus j. So what you are having there is the unit normal that we are looking for is minus j.